This is a practice pistol. My dad gave it to me uh, just for practicing with targeting. We like target shooting in my family. What I wanted to show you about this pistol is we've had it in the family for a few years now and over a years of use, the sight's a little bit off. When I pull the trigger back a little bit, you see it makes a red dot right there. And that red dot is supposed to be where the bullet hits. But when I pull it back all the way, that's where the bullet's hitting. Now, in an ideal, ideal world with a gun that's actually in alignment, <laughs> your, your two lights should actually be in the same place. Notice that the sights are off on here. Where the bullet is hitting is not actually where the red dot tells you that you're aiming, right? As you pull back, unfortunately, this little bitty gap here, further you pull back, the more and more you can see over this leaf, the more and more they spread back. Now I'm showing you this as an illustration of why we fast every January. We fast twice a year. We fast in January and we fast in the summer. And each one of those times is just like taking this pistol and making sure that your target, where you're aiming and where it's actually hitting are in alignment. We take a week what I do is encourage all of our members to take just one meal at least where they're not eating and they're using that time instead to focus on God, reading their Bible, listening to worship music. It's not a time to do more work. It's a time to specifically hang out with God. And what that does in our lives, that hanging out with God, that being intentional about focusing on Him, it puts our sights back into alignment. And if we're not doing that in our lives, as we move along throughout the year, where we're hitting with our lives gets further and further from the target that God wants for us to be aiming at. He wants to help us hit dead on, right in the center of the target. And as we walk in intimacy with Him, we're able to do that and live according to His will. As we're not being intentional with Him, as we're not focusing on Him, as we're not allowing Him to adjust our lives, we're going to get further and further from the target. So join us next week, starting Sunday, we're going to spend time together and with God focusing on, on our intimacy, our identity, and our influence. But very first and foremost is focusing on our intimacy with God and in a community with one another. And we're going to meet and have special meetings on Thursday night, on Friday night, and on Saturday night. If you want more information, please email us. Uh, we look forward to hanging out.